Welcome to a demonstration of how to use the Know-It-All Informatics Systems Analyze at Polymer IR application. IR spectroscopy is widely used to identify, classify, and interpret polymers. However, because commercial polymers are often blends of materials, they are often challenging materials to identify. Spectral searching against databases has traditionally been used to identify and classify polymer compounds. However, there are cases when more information is desired, such as spectral structure correlation. This is where Analyze at Polymer IR, in tandem with a knowledge base of polymer spectral structure correlations, can help. The Analyze at Polymer IR knowledge base can provide clear and rapid verification and identification of functional groups in the mid-infrared. It features over 100 functional groups and hundreds of interpretation frequencies. The main classifications are shown here. In addition to the knowledge base, here is a list of key features. Many of these will be shown as we demonstrate how the Analyze at Polymer IR software can help you to interpret and classify infrared spectra of polymers. We will examine two spectra, one mixture, and one pure compound. We begin with the spectrum of a polymer that is known to be a mixture. Use the Preferences dialog box to check that the appropriate knowledge base is selected. There are three ways to select a peak to correlate. You can allow the application to suggest a peak, select a peak by clicking on the spectrum, or manually type in a peak position. In general, it is best to begin a correlation with a peak above 1500 wave numbers that is unique and strong. The Analyze at Polymer IR application uses a set of rules to select a good starting point. Choose Suggest a Peak to Correlate on the Analyze menu or click the Suggest a Peak toolbar button. Continue clicking to see other suggestions. Once a peak has been selected, click the Correlate toolbar button. The application analyzes the knowledge base for correlations and displays the results in a tab marked with the peak's wave number value. The entries in the functional group data pane are listed in alphabetical order by chemical class. As each entry is selected, the corresponding fragment structure and predicted peaks are displayed. This entry appears to be a good match. Right-click to add it to the Summary Plus tab. The next two entries are also good matches. We can view the contents of the Summary Plus tab. We see that these functional groups account for most of the peaks in the mixture spectrum. Next, we will examine the spectrum from a single polymer compound. Click the Suggest a Peak toolbar button for possible starting points. Then, click the Correlate toolbar button. Once again, we can examine the entries in the functional group data pane. This entry appears to be a good match. Another useful feature in Analyze at Polymer IR is the ability to display reference spectra. Click the Toggle Reference Spectrum toolbar button. The reference spectrum appears in the spectral pane. Next, we will expand the selected entry in the functional group data pane to view more detailed information. This entry includes detailed notes. This concludes the introduction to the Analyze at Polymer IR application.